As the rate of technological advancement continues to accelerate at an ever-increasing rate, humanity is coming to a crossroads. On the one hand, we are set to become a spacefaring race that will eventually colonize the stars. However, we are still confined to Earth, and as our weapons improve, our capability of self-destruction continues to improve. The next few decades will usher in awesome and destructive technological weapons. What are some of these and how disruptive are they? Here are 10 potential future weapons which may have big impacts on our civilization if they are misused. At 10 are fully automated drones. Presently, most drones have a human operator behind them, and the decision to kill a target from a distance is still made by a human. However, as drones are exploding in popularity and capability, an open letter was recently published on the Future of Life Institute. The letter urged to ban autonomous weapons with no human control. They urged that while drones can easily target whatever a human wants, they could end up in the wrong hands, making terrorism and effortless killing of civilians much easier. On top of this, the technology is only a few years away. Coming in at 9 are hypersonic missiles. These missiles are capable of travelling at hypersonic speeds, with China having recently tested a nuclear capable missile with speeds of above 12,359 km per hour, which is Mach 10. In comparison, ballistic missiles travel at speeds of just 965 km an hour. This is so fast that there are currently no known systems capable of shooting down one of these missiles after it is launched. The implementation of these missiles could disrupt the entire theatre of warfare. At 8 is the railgun. While conventional missiles can cost up to half a million dollars to fire, a railgun can shoot a projectile for just $25,000. This projectile is propelled by electromagnetic pulses, which propel the projectile to a speed of Mach 7. At this incredible speed, no explosives are needed. The sheer force of the explosion is likened to being hit by a train smashing through a wall at high speed. The railgun is almost ready to be deployed as well, and the US Navy is considering adding it onto their Zumwalt destroyer. Coming in at 7 is the EMP. EMP stands for Electromagnetic Pulse, a nuclear weapon fired into the high atmosphere by a rogue state or two warring nations could interact with the atmosphere, ionosphere and magnetosphere of the Earth, causing electromagnetic damage to electronics, wiping out the entire sections of electronics and information systems to entire regions. Such a blast could wipe out up to 70% of a country's power grid and could possibly destabilize a nation with all systems collapsing. A report from the EMP Commission has stated that the threat is actually greater than ever, with terrorist organizations having greater capability of acquiring such weapons than rogue states such as North Korea already trialing nuclear weapons. At 6 is a super virus. The bird flu has only had a few cases of human transmission having actually been reported. However, some scientists have succeeded in making bird flu airborne in labs. With a 59% mortality rate, this could kill up to half the world's population, if not more. Super viruses are so deadly, an intentional release may not even be necessary. Even an accidental release could cause enough damage to kill millions of people. Coming in at 5 is augmented humans. DARPA recently announced the development of a chip to be implanted in soldiers' brains, which would allow them to communicate directly with computers. The enhancement of humans will have profound effects on humanity. Some humans may be unable to keep up with the rate of advancement, and different levels of enhanced and unenhanced humans may emerge. On the battlefield, an enhanced human would be much more powerful than their unenhanced counterparts, with increased cognition, full body bulletproof armor, and direct neural control of computers. At 4 are antimatter bombs. It is estimated that 1 gram of antimatter coming into contact with 1 gram of normal matter would release up to 42.96 kilotons of TNT, with this being 3 times the power of the atom bomb dropped on Hiroshima. In comparison to the 2 grams of antimatter needed, the Hiroshima nuke had 64 kilos of enriched uranium inside. Since only a small amount of antimatter would be needed, the possibility of a pocket-sized weapon could be possible. However, antimatter is extremely hard and expensive to produce currently. Such weapons may be over a century away, if not longer. Relativistic kill vehicles come in at free. Not all superweapons need to be smart. A half-meter tungsten rod fired from space could accelerate up to 10 times the speed of sound. Being able to fire from anywhere, it could hit a target with the power of a small nuclear weapon. However, on the larger scale, a relativistic kill vehicle is a weapon that can be accelerated to a significant fraction of the speed of light. Such a weapon could have enough energy to destroy a planet. Such incredible speeds, it would be impossible to stop, since even destroying it would just create a shower of smaller projectiles, each containing a devastating amount of energy from its speed. Coming in at 2 are nanoweapons. Nanotechnology is the creation and engineering of manipulation of matter on the atomic scale. One of the deadliest forms of nanoweaponry could be self-replicating nanorobots. 
Self-replicating nanorobots are the creation of a self-replicating robot capable of turning the biosphere into more copies of itself. While the creation of a self-replicating nanorobot is unlikely to be made by accident and unlikely to come from human hands, a super-intelligent agent could feasibly build a highly effective version of it. Simpler nano devices capable of entering a person's bloodstream could easily inject toxins and has been estimated by the Center for Responsible Nanotechnology that only around a suitcase full of toxin-carrying nanorobots would be enough to eliminate the human race. The deadliest weapon we could create would be one smarter than ourselves. The current state of AI allows for the creation of autonomous drones in the near future. However, this is ANI, Artificial Narrow Intelligence, which specializes in only one kind of task, an AGI, artificial general intelligence, given a task would quickly gather information and become smarter than any human on the planet. Any AI with enough power could feasibly be the greatest existential threat we face if it is not programmed properly, since once we turn it on, it would be too smart to stop whatever order it is given. So which technology could become a future super weapon? Was there something on the list that was missing? Leave a comment below and thanks for watching.